Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a quick video showing you how to reach the first boss in Dark Souls 3 DLC because it took me a while to get to it so I figured if you get stuck you might want some help and this video is for that. So let's get into the gameplay. Okay guys, so basically when you start the DLC and you go to the cleansing chapel you'll be transported to the painted world of Ariander. And I'm basically just going to do a quick rundown so I'm going to be where the boss is how to get to the shortcuts as well. So let's do this. Now for this area, if you want to run past it, you want to save up a bit of stamina because if you look up here, there's a massive ass wolf. And I haven't actually taken him on yet because that is just insanity. Pure insanity. So guys, you want to <coughs> just run past him and then you come to this area with these massive ass... Go, wolf, go away. With these massive ass, like, I don't know, henchmen. And they hit really hard. So if you want to run, run past them, then you can. In that tower, there's just loot. There's not really anything up there. So there's actually two ways you can go. There's one here, there's one here. You want to go to the furthest one and just run up here. <coughs> Again, another big wolf. Save a stamina and you can just run past. And fall down. I forgot that happened. Okay. <laughs> This is pretty safe around here. Again, just keep running. And then if you turn back around, there's another pathway up there, but we don't need to go there just yet. Carry on this way, you will see a bridge. And if you turn to your right, there will be a bonfire. So just sit down at the bonfire. <coughs> Once you set at the bonfire, you're gonna wanna run across this bridge. But this isn't actually the way we're going. We just need to talk to someone first. Okay, when you get here, obviously I've been here before, there'll be a guy standing here. You can just talk to him and go in. He's not gonna hurt you or anything. And then you'll be in here. Another bonfire, yay. But this here, someone will be sat here and you've got to speak to them. I'll try and add in a clip. And then once you speak to them, you gotta run back, you just gotta run. Okay, once you come back towards the bonfire, you'll then see a ladder to the left of the bridge. And you wanna descend this ladder. And you'll come across this room with an NPC here. So yes, NPC there. You can talk to them if you want, you don't have to. I'm not gonna force you. Okay, so up there is a gate. I've already opened it, but to open it, go this way. Avoid Wolverine if you want to. And you can just run past all of this. Okay guys, if you go this way, you can jump down and open the gate. So I'll just jump down now because the gate's already open. 
and that's sort of her bit. But I wanted to heal up. So yeah, and then you come across to this building. In this building is a um, a knight, and you have to kill him. You have no choice. You have to kill him, and he will drop a key. Once he drops a key, you can go over to this lever and use the contraption key to you to use this, and this will open up <coughs> this for you. So you run up here. You look around. And then to the right, there'll be a drop down point. And you can drop down here, and lo and behold, there is another bonfire. Yay! Also, you're going to want to open this gate, because if you don't, then shortcuts will be broken off later. Okay, this part is where it gets a bit <coughs> confusing. This part is massive, and you get chased a lot. So, to run through this part, you're gonna need bars of steel. Just big bars of steel. Okay, guys, when you get to around here. You will see a massive tree trunk like this, but it'll be standing up. Just kick it down for fun, right? Good. Let me clear that up. And then you just carry on running. Again guys, there's another tree to kick down here. Kick it down and access this area really easily. Once you get in here, it's sort of really gross. You'll see there's... What is that wolf doing? Right. Run away from the flies, because they're so gross you don't want to deal with them. You head over this way. Here will be an invisible door, you can hit it, obviously, and then run down the stairs. And if that doesn't work, you can just drop down to the right. Right, this is where it gets really difficult. Well, not difficult, but really intense. You want to run this way. You just, you just want to run. Till you get to this. Turn this lever, and that will activate a cutscene. That will show you where the final boss is. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this playthrough slash little tip thing. Thingamajing. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!